So in our second uh, genetic extensions video, we're going to be discussing a similar uh, type of inheritance, similar to incomplete dominance, but not exactly the same. Here we have a red cow. That's going to be one of our homozygous individuals. Here we have a white cow. And here is what we would call a roan cow. That is obviously going to be our heterozygote. But notice, unlike our heterozygote, with our flowers with incomplete dominance where the red and the white mixed and you got sort of a middle color. We obviously don't have a pink cow, but even then we don't have like a, a light red cow, right? We have a spotted cow. We can see in the heterozygote both the white and the red. They didn't mix like paint, but they still exist on the same individual. This is going to be a pattern of inheritance called codominance. Notice that co obviously means with or together and dominant. So we're going to actually have, we're going to consider this having two um, dominant traits here being inherited together. Um, so instead, again, when we define our variables, we can use a capital R again for red. However, because we're having two dominant traits, we will use a second capital letter for our other allele. And this is going to be white. So, our two extremes, we have two R's, that'll give us a red cow. We can have two W's, capital W's, that would give us a white cow. And we can have our heterozygote with a capital R and a capital W, that will get us the roan cow. And going back to the pictures, I um, made the analogy of paint to be like incomplete dominance, well, the analogy for codominance could be like say you have Skittles and you have um, green Skittles and blue Skittles. If you put them together in a bag, you don't somehow get like a blue-green Skittle. You still have blue Skittles and green Skittles in the same bag. That's going to be like our own cows. We have red and white on the same cow. They don't mix to form a new color, but you see both at the same time.